Well, this past weekend in mid-Missouri, Animal Brook Shelter broke records and more than 150 pets found homes. Ryan Rumba joins us live from the shelter with one of the organizers. Good morning, Ryan. Yes, good morning, guys. We're at the Central Missouri Humane Society. We're out in Columbia right now. And yes, this weekend, they adopted so many pets. So exciting. I'm here this morning with Colin. You're with the Humane Society. Good morning. Hi, thanks for coming out. Let's talk about the weekend. How exciting. We are all so pleased with how it went. Mm -hmm. um, normally, spring and summer are busy intake months, and that tapers off in the fall. But we weren't seeing that this year. That we're still getting a lot of intakes, and we mm -hmm. kind of had to act on our feet. And that's when we decided to do the $3 special, and we just had some record-breaking adoptions last weekend. So it weekend. was $3 for any pet in the whole? Pretty much. The vast majority of the pets here were available for $3 last weekend. Okay. That covered the spaying and neutering, the wow. microchip, uh, up to date on all vaccinations. So it was I mean, a pretty good deal. It might as well be free, right? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> you pay a coffee. You get a coffee for $3. Exactly. You can get a pet. And tell me about how many pets were adopted this weekend. Well, our previous single day adoption <clears throat> record was uh, 34. and In a day, right? In a day. 34 in a day. Okay. So on Friday, we adopted out 50. On Saturday, we adopted out 69. Holy cow. And on Sunday, we adopted out 39 for a total of 158 adoptions over three days. And you guys have never done that before. Never. <laughs> never before. And, uh, you know, it was wonderful to come in on Monday and see so many empty kennels mm -hmm. and cat condos. But you still have more pets. And Absolutely. we've got one right here. So tell me about this guy. Hello. Good grief. It's Charlie Brown. <laughs> <laughs> Charlie Brown is an eight-year-old chocolate lab. He's a super sweet guy. And he does not look like he's eight and he doesn't behave like it either. No, not he's at all. He's like a puppy. He Hello. still has a lot of puppy energy. He's very loving. He's very smart. Hey, Charlie, sit. Oh, good boy. Shake. Oh. Yes. He's, he's awesome. Yay. So he's available for adoption now. Yes, he's available along with many other uh, fur babies here at the shelter. <laughs> <laughs> so if you are interested in adopting Charlie Brown, come on into the Central Missouri Humane Society. There are plenty more pets. We're going to come back in a little bit and we're going to see some more pets. So for now, we'll send it back to you guys. Hey guys, uh, we are at the Central Missouri Humane Society this morning, and I've been hanging out with Colin. Good morning. Hey. Well, and we were talking about your great success this past weekend. For those who are just tuning in, how did it go this weekend? Uh, we had some record-breaking adoptions. Mm -hmm. uh, our previous record was uh, for single-day on-site adoptions was 34. Uh, on Friday of last week, we adopted out 50, and then on Saturday, 69. Sunday, 39 for a grand total of 158 adoptions over three days. It's crazy to think that that many animals were in this building at one time. It must have been packed. Well, yeah, it was packed, but it wasn't just animals that were in this building. Okay. Uh, we wouldn't be able to do what we do without our foster network, our okay. network of foster parents. Uh, we have a lot of people in the community that temporarily house animals for us whenever we get full, mm -hmm. and that really helps us out when we're in a pinch. So you guys have got plenty of dogs and cats now, not as many as this weekend, and we've got some kittens down here. Tell me about these guys. Uh, these little fellas are uh, <laughs> three-month-old domestic short short hair, gray tabbies. They are so cute. Yeah, and so we thought we'd bring them out and share the adorableness. Yes. <laughs> I am definitely a cat person, so I, what you're saying. <laughs> yes, I am loving this. I gotta, I gotta hold myself back from wanting to adopt everything. So <laughs> definitely cute. And if people are interested in adopting, how can they get more information? Uh, you can go to our website www.cmhspets.org. That has all the uh, animals that we have available for adoption listed there. It's updated mm -hmm. in real time with what we have available. But you can also come down to the shelter. Our application process really isn't that big of a deal. It just takes a couple minutes to get approved. Mm -hmm and uh, you can interact with all the fur babies we have here. <laughs> I feel like once you're here, you're going to get sucked in. <laughs> you're not leaving without one. These are so adorable. We're going to come back in a little bit and see some more pets, probably another dog. But for now, we'll send it back to you guys. Well, moving on, an adoption event at a mid-Missouri animal shelter broke some records over the weekend. Ryan Rumba has been hanging out at the Central Missouri Humane Society this morning and joins us with more. Yes, good morning, guys. We're at the Humane Society this morning in Columbia, and I think I'm going to do a segment like this every day because I absolutely just love hanging out with all these pets. I'm here this morning with Colin. Good morning. Hey, good morning. Thanks for having us out so early. Now, who's this? This is Lefty. He was a stray uh, that was brought into the shelter. He's a year and a half old uh, pit bull mix, oh, he's and a he's sweetie. a real sweetie. Oh. And he's knocking me over. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, he's, he's strong with his love, that's for sure. Now, the, for those who just turned, uh, just tuned in, um, 
So how did this weekend go? Uh, well, we had a really big adoption special event. We offered our lowest adoption fees ever. And uh, over the course of three days, we adopted out 158 pets, which oh, was a, bit, a new record for the shelter. That is great. Great to see all these pets get homes. And I understand you guys have a rescue program. Explain that a little bit. Yeah. Um, aside from adopting out animals, another way that we're able to save lives here at the Central Missouri Humane Society is uh, we have a really wonderful uh, rescue coordinator at the shelter and she sends animals out to rescues all over the United States. She mm -hmm. sent animals as far as New York and Arizona and last year she sent out 797 dogs and cats oh to these gosh. rescues but this year she's just really outdoing herself and she's actually broken that record and she sent out over 800 animals so far. Oh my gosh that's crazy to think about all these animals that you know don't have homes and it's just heartbreaking even being here and looking at all the pets you know in their cages you just want to take them all. It's, it's hard to <laughs> deny them, that's for sure. Yes, definitely. <laughs> well, thank you for all that you do in keeping these pets safe. If you guys are interested in adopting either a dog or a cat or even any other small animal, you can check out Central Missouri Humane Society's website. It's cmhspets.org, correct? Yep. Yes. And we will also have more information on our Facebook page. For now, we'll send it back to you guys.